Hi there, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to introduce you all a long lost recipe. See, this is um, from many years, myself also never cooked this. Suddenly, when I thought of it, then I start thinking, recall back the recipe. So, this is called uh, no, Ayam Masa Buah Keras Cara Nyonya. Yeah? So, it's spicy chicken with candle nut. Okay? So, this is what are the ingredients we needed. Okay? So, we need uh, chicken here, a uh, chicken part about one and a half k kilogram and thick coconut sun armor about two cups and uh, some coffee leaf uh, le uh, lemon fruit eh? so it's about eight to ten pieces and two crushed lengkwa, uh, serai is lemongrass and then th 30 gram dry chili 80 gram fresh red chili, 200 gram Thai shallot, and one and a half cup of water, 30 gram of turmeric, and 30 gram of galanga, and four stalks of serai, lemongrass, and uh, 60 gram of wakras candle nut, and some sugar. It's approximately about one teaspoon and then chicken granule stock is about one and a half teaspoon and salt is about three quarter tablespoon okay now I shall um, blend uh, grind all the ingredients uh. all the ingredients there are the chili the shallot the uh, lemongrass lengkwas or uh, glangal uh, we call and turmeric, uh, kunyit. This thing I have to grind first. Then only we can prepare and we can cook the chicken. Okay, so I put aside all this. So this is all the in, uh, in, in grinded ingredient to be uh, grind together. This candle nut, chili oil, and the fresh chili. So now got to be grinded. Add some water. So this is the paste uh, already uh, grinded. So add in all the chicken pieces into it and marinate for 10 to 15 minutes only. Uh, we don't marinate too long because uh, when we cook that time we have to simmer also. So not necessary to uh, too long to marinate lah. If we don't simmer, yes, we need to marinate it a bit longer mm -hmm. 
so we can add in all the salt inside uh, the salt and then the sun and the sugar okay we just leave it for 10 to 15 minutes okay uh, now 15 minutes already uh, enough uh, for the marinating the chicken so i'm going to put it in the heated wood yeah to make it simmer uh, for a few minutes gently and slowly overturn the chicken uh, then we stir until the paste is dry now you can see they are wet right slightly wet so until it is uh, dry and then the chicken also becoming uh, a bit strange then we can add in the santan Okay, now we can add in the thick uh, coconut milk as the chicken uh, already looks strange a bit and the gravy also is slightly dry. Okay, it's thickened. Eh? So we can put. I didn't pour all la uh, wait afterward I see if sometimes the chicken is tender or not very and then you pour too much it becomes soft too tender the chicken becomes too soft and it break you know so it just uh, you all decide your own okay so I will add half of the water first and then let it cover if now it's uh, all fully boiling and then I will add in the coffee leaf eh? and remove root. You know you have to, uh, you need to crush it a bit, okay. Why you add only now? Eh? Because make it more fragrant. If too early, the coffee leaf, uh, the, the smell will disappear, you see. Okay, cover it up for a short while, okay? Off and on, now you need to stir. prefer it to look uh, not yellow a bit darker color uh, normally I add a little bit of black uh, this soya sauce eh? just a bit only uh, let's say it's about half a teaspoon would do make the color look more nice because yellow <laughs> and normally I cook rendang or whatever I will cook a bit uh, black sauce so it looks uh, dark soya sauce, so it looks a bit colored nicer. Now the chicken is almost uh, done. I got to lower the fire. Let it a bit uh, drier, a bit dry, a bit slightly.
yeah, how you test the chicken, especially the dumb drumstick, yeah, sometimes it doesn't cook, you know. So you just pierce it with the forks, pick it with the forks, and then when you remove the forks, you see clear water come out, that means it's cooked. If you see like blood stains, that means it's still not, it's still not cooked. Yeah? So this is cooked already, especially the drumstick, because the drum, drumstick is quite a, a thick, you see, meaty there. Let it sit for a while. So now it's uh, done. It's uh, you can see all appear also because of the coconut. Yeah, because I didn't stir, I didn't add oil. You see, uh, so now it's the oil from the coconut, and then um, it's done ready. So we can off the fire. I just let you all know. Uh, but to my recipe, uh, I just now I told you the coconut is about 500 ml. Only I use only 300 ml because the chicken is a bit tender, so I don't want to use a lot because of it. Yeah, and the water is only about half a bowl of vanilla. So you all just do follow lah if your desire. If you see the chicken is tough, then you can add all lah, the coconut water. Uh, the coconut juice and the water eh? now I'm going to off the fire it's all done already but my chicken looks so nice intact eh? not broken yeah so now scoop up and serve okay my dish ayam masak chili buah keras cara nyonya already done okay so uh, you normally this one can be served with rice white rice and then can even eat with nasi lemak or you can even eat with bread or ketupat rice is very nice you eat all this because it's this is a uh, spicy and there's a lemak there did the creamy uh, taste so it blend well with all this rice bread and nasi lemak okay so thank you for watching my video and hope you can like, share and subscribe. Thank you.